Okay, guys, so I want to show you what we're going to be doing here today in class. You're going to want to go to my website, click on the first link, and this is going to be a lesson on types of terrorism. So what I did was I went ahead and did a blog, and what you're going to be doing is talking about types of the history of terrorism, and what so it's going to be 30 points. Uh, the task is you're going to study history and types of terrorism, and then you will write a paragraph that paragraph is going to answer the essential question of the lesson. You're also going to be asked to look at other students' work um, and respond to what they say. And there's expectations for that, too, and I'll be, get, be getting to that. Um, you get 10 points for answering the essential question, 5 points for listing a relevant website. I want you to do that, too, is find a good website. That should include you know, nothing inappropriate like a public beheading. Um, and this is not a site that should promote terrorism. This should be something that uh, educates us. And then you'll get 15 points for reacting to two fellow students' work. It's due Wednesday at 5, uh, to, uh, and we're going to understand the history of terrorism. So what you'll want to do here is actually um, find this link on my blog, and you want to open that in a new tab. Let that load up. So then you will see here that there's a PowerPoint. Let that come up, and you'll be able to view it, and you will see everything that's in that, and you will do that by scrolling down. Some of this stuff is, you know, do now is over the years, but and you could ignore some of the um, note-taking information if it doesn't help you learn. But I want you to go through and view these things. And then with, with each of these types of terror, like terror by people against the government, terror by national groups, those are the different types of terror that I'm hoping you'll understand. I've tried to conceptualize this topic and break it down into different types of terror. So um, that'll be the educational stuff for you. Also in this link, if you close this, there are videos. And the videos will match with different types of terror. And if you need help, um, you know, with these videos and which ones match which type, please let me know, email me or, or call me over in class. Um, so there's that. I've also put a soft copy of the book here if you want it um, to take a look. And again, this is all online. You can get this from anywhere. Going back to the blog, um, I said here there are different types of terrorism. These are the different types. After studying, you're going to answer this uh, essential question. Um, and that's going to be your blog post that you're going to you're going to be what you're going to be commenting on. Um, you're going to post your answer, and then I also said you need to post the website. Uh, no inappropriate sites. Uh, nothing that's going to promote terrorism or promote violence. You have to find educational sites. And then number three, you're going to read other people's posts and react to the two other posts. Okay. And I, what I did was I went ahead and I listed expectations for you know people who may be wondering how much should I post. So I actually um, stole this from my teacher. Uh, this is what our expectations are for discussing. And I don't expect you guys to perform at a graduate level, but I do, I hope, I think this will guide you regarding um, what I expect. And we can, this is our first time trying this, and I understand, but hopefully it'll help, help you understand what is Mr. Del Priori expecting. So kind of take this um, expectations and try to boil it down a little bit lower to a high school level. And then you're going to go ahead and comment here. And when you comment there, you can sign in, um, you know, under your Google file. Or you can sign in under anonymous. And then you're going to go ahead and publish it when you're ready to publish it. And then you have your comment here and you're done. Of course, yours is not going to just say hello. It'll have your paragraph, a website. And then you'll need to, once as people post, you'll need to go through and um, read what people say and react to what they say based on the blog expe expectations. So I hope you find this interesting and fun, and I hope you learn. And don't forget to contact me with any questions. Happy learning. Bye-bye.